What's good, y'all? This is your boy, Black G92. Shout out to Justin Bosman and Ransom Bance for requesting me to react to this music video made by a rapper named Hunnic Kufis. If that's how you pronounce his name, correct me if I'm wrong, and it's simply titled and straight to the point, Nick Cannon This, which I'm guessing is a response to all those piss poor diss records Nick Cannon made towards Eminem and all the shit he just said about him. But we're going to have to check out the lyrics just to make sure that's the case. Which I'm definitely thinking that it really is. But I'm going to see for, for, I'm gonna see for myself. And this is a blind reaction. My first time like reacting to this music video. I've seen a, a few people reacting to it. Haven't looked at those. So I'm going to just come to just blind and no type of preconceived notions about it. So... We'll see how it's sounding in about three, two, one. Make sure the volume turned up. You know, your boy likes his volume just higher than a motherfucker. I'm about to shit on these niggas, call a custodian. You know them niggas fold and they grew up on Nickelodeon. You know my temper short. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Damn, this nigga right. <laughs> I'm about to shit on these niggas, call a custodian. You know them niggas fold and they grew up on Nickelodeon. You know my temper short, you fucking with the Napoleon. Dynamite explode while you standing up at the podium. You should have took my homie's advice when he said I'm the illest nigga ever holding a mic. Damn. Honey, Kofi and Eminem is like Kobe and Mike. Now I'm bringing it to your door like you owe me a fight. Come on, stop. Now get it right. Damn. <laughs> this nigga just came out the gate just shit on. Nick can literally shit on Vince like the shit, the pooping sound. And... It's hitting with bars, it's, especially if the line was like, how, saying how Nick can't go in against Eminem. It was like, so and so going against Napoleon, some shit like that. And oh, dude was like, I'm coming at your front door. It was like, damn, bro. <laughs> what would Nick did to you? But <laughs> shit. Like, I guess in Koofies, it's like, look, man, I'm a service fool. <laughs> Don't even try to react to this clown, him. I got you. <laughs> That's what I'm getting from this video. And not to mention, it's over the instrumental of, you know. Wanna fuck with Shady, cause Shady will fucking kill you. That song, like, for those that don't know, that was the instrument, that's the instrument that Koofy's rapping over. So, go see how the rest of these lyrics are. I gotta play it back, cause this nigga going, like, fast as a motherfucker. Like, catch these bars. Should've took my homie's advice when he said I'm the illest nigga ever holding a mic. Honey, Koofy and Eminem is like Kobe and Mike. Now I'm bringing it to your door like you owe me a fight. Oh! Oh, okay, okay. He's saying him and him and Eminem are like Kobe and Mike. Like the you know how Kobe and Michael Jordan are like the greatest basketball players of their respective <clears throat> scratch that how everyone says Michael Jordan and Kobe are like the greatest basketball players of all time. That's what Kobe's essentially saying himself and Eminem are like just the greatest rappers of all. So <laughs> that's what that's what he meant. Okay. Let's get to let's get straight to it. Now get it right. I'm gonna show you how to spit it right. Seven years in a pen. I don't need a pen to write. This is life. I don't think you want to get me hype. I'll be sitting in your bushes waiting for a nigga at night. And I ain't leaving the trail. I'll be at your front door with a fat bull ringing a bell. Told the guard at the gate we was bringing the mail. When he asked us who we were, we said Keenan and Cal. Well, ain't too many fucking with me on the rap scene. My flow's sick and they couldn't find a vaccine. You coming at the rap god and you a rap queen. I'm riding with you. <laughs> <laughs> man, ain't that the truth, man? Cause if we all know, like, it should not be even like repeat. It should not even be a surprise. Like, you know, Nick Cannon wilding out um Eight Mile Detroit, like May songs going at this damn near everybody. Like, and talks not only this is himself and his mother. Like, dude is set, Eminem is savage when it comes to the comes to like. His music, whatever, when it comes to lyrics. Nick, never been on that tip. And hence the line, like, going against a rap guy, you're a rap queen. <laughs> oh, man. Koofy's in them with straight facts. <laughs> Especially also when we mention on the line, like, I'm popping up, at your, popping up in your bushes like Nick at night. <laughs> like, you know, reference to the whole segment. Like Nickelodeon at night, literally, like it starts around like eight thirty, nine o'clock ish in the PM. Yeah, but let me go ahead and finish this heat right here. I'm, damn, this dude is man. 
This dude is talented as a motherfucker. Let me see. Let me go ahead and play it back real quick. Ain't too many fucking with me on the rap scene. My flow is sick and they couldn't find a vaccine. Mm. You're coming at the rap god and you a rap Woo. queen. I'm riding with him and I'm still on the black team. You should have put me on Wild and Out a year ago since I didn't get the audition. Well, here it go. You hear the flow, now you get to listen to me now. Growling on the beat like I'm coming to rap a tree down. Texas Chainsaw with his brains all running down his face like them bitches going AWOL. Hey, y'all. I'm the lyrical Adolf, so if you rockin' Jews, you know what I come to take off. And that's literally over your head, over some bread, have a thing that's... Oh, oh, man, that was slick. That shit was slick right there. Like, you see, he compares how... And a lot of these compares up to Adolf and Ju, the Ju, Jules, Jews, the whole time. like, you know, I came to take... Oh, shit. Man, that was an ill-ass line right there, bro. I gotta play that shit back again. Rerun, rerun. Bitches going AWOL. Hey, y'all. Hey, I'm the lyrical Adolf. So if you rockin' Jews, you know what I come to take off. <laughs> Damn, that shit was fire, man. Straight flames. Damn. How the fuck come him? How the fuck he came up with this shit, man? He definitely is a stain. It definitely is a big fan of him. Cause boy, this boy, this dude's man, I'm already impressed. <laughs> I'm already impressed. Your head over some bread, have a nigga standing over your bed with a pillow over your mouth. I know that you scared, you know what this shit is for, Nick. You know what you said. This is just a warning shot. You war with shock. I pull up to your door and stop. And I don't give a fuck who you got on your side. You better pray that your doors is locked. <laughs> so if you really want to settle this shit, I want eighty-five percent of incredible Nick. Let me change your whole past, cause most of them dudes trash. Everybody on your team looking edible, Nick. See, I'm trying to be nice and bring the comedy out. If I spit it the other way, I go the robbery route. It's got a cloud that I'm chasing, but I don't think it's cloud. Just a loud motherfucker that's way he be wildin' out. Ah! You need to ask Suge what he think. He gassed you mm, up. Hold on, let me go ahead and rewind this shit again. Everybody on your team looking edible, Nick. You see, I'm trying to be nice and bring the comedy out. If I spit it the other way, I go to robbery route. Mm. It's got a cloud that I'm chasing, but I don't think it's cloud. Just a loud motherfucker that's way he be wildin' out. Ooh. You need to ask Suge what he think. He gassed you up. Now you got Suge in your tank. <laughs> Call Hattie up. He said, get the mug out the bank and bet whatever you want. No Philly, nigga. Ay. And we don't play when it comes to this gunplay. You ride down the block, you going out one way. Mm. So you better pray like grandmama on Sunday. That you don't see that chopper come out of that Hyundai. Shit right here. <laughs> Damn. So we actually met Nick Cannon, and actually, I guess in by the first to last picture, like it seemed like he was spinning the freestyle for him, and they and they also took a picture together, posted, and uh, it maybe some business deal that went wrong. And I'm guessing Nick Cannon decided to roll with the people he's rolling with, which, in all honesty, I'm not too sure about Charlie Clips or Hitman Holla, but. Based on just the records that was on with Nick on those two disc, terrible disc records, they're, they're pretty trash on those records. I don't know how Charlie Clips is on the battle of rap circuit. So I can't really say, like, dude's trash on that end, but on the records, they were trash. So, oh, especially Prince Easy, man. <laughs> dude did not have no type of substance at all. So I don't know why Nick decided to roll with Prince Easy, but, you know. With these industry type people, they're going to roll with who's got the big name, who got the most clout, <laughs> and easy on the is, whatever, not a, not a very difficult to decipher rap style, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> maybe, like I said, maybe some behind the scenes stuff happened. Maybe Nick can just pass him up. That's why Honey Koopies made this disc record in. Also, another line I liked when, like, he, when Koopies... Professor, like, look, I'm right for him, but I'm still down with the black team. Throw with the black this and shit. Let him know, like, look, this ain't no coon shit. Like, I, I'm still a black guy. I'm still right, right for my peoples, whatever. But I'm standing up for, for, my, for my man's M right now. Because what he doing, like, because <laughs> what, what Nick and Black Squad were doing was some straight 
BS for real. <laughs> and also the line was talking about some sugar gassy well, even though you got sugar in your tank. Boy, this this dude got some hella quotables. I'm definitely looking forward to reacting to more Honey Koofy songs. So Brent, keep the requests coming, man. Keep the requests coming. And damn, I forgot. What was I about to say after this? What was I about to say after this? Man, those, those bars just have me just brain is going, man. <laughs> it, it had my brain is going, like, for real. Especially this way he was flowing and everything. Like, this, I mean, <laughs> uh, I'm definitely going to have this on repeat. Now, anyone that has not heard the song yet or seen the music video, let me know in the comment section what you think of it. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel. I got more reactions on the way. Send me requests, all that good shit. This is Black G92. About to sign off. Holla at your boy. Peace.